Trier is an incredible place packed with history. In fact, it's even said to be the oldest city in Germany. In the 4th century, it became one of the largest cities of the Roman Empire, and Trier continued to be an important seat of power throughout the Holy Roman Empire as well. So come along, and we'll unpack some of its history by visiting seven of Trier's most fascinating places. First up is Porta Nigra. The name means Black Gate in Latin, and it was constructed in 170 AD by the Romans. It's made up of over 7,200 sandstone blocks, some of which weigh up to six tons. The gate was turned into a church starting in the 11th century, and it stayed that way until 1804, when Napoleon had the church dismantled. The areas in blue are the portions of the church which were removed to reveal the ancient Roman gate. Though traces of its Christian past can still be seen. A small admission fee lets you freely explore the structure and take in the beautiful views over Trier. Number two is the Hauptmarkt, or the main market of the old medieval town. This was the center of Trier in the Middle Ages, and it remains so today. Der Petrusbrunnen, or St. Peter's Fountain, was placed here in 1595, in honor of St. Peter, patron saint of Trier. With the key to heaven in his hand, he's kept watch over this square for over 400 years. Next up is Trierer Dome, also known as Trier Cathedral. Most of the structure you see here dates back to the 11th century, but some of its walls were built by the Romans, making this the oldest church in Germany. Trier Cathedral is an important pilgrimage for Catholics around the world, mainly because it houses what some believe to be the actual tunic worn by Jesus shortly before his crucifixion. According to legend, Empress Helena, mother of Constantine the Great, discovered the relic in Jerusalem and brought it back to Trier in the year 327 AD. It's also important to mention that Helena's son, Constantine, was the first Roman emperor to convert to Christianity. In the year 313, he signed the Edict of Milan, which granted protection from persecution for Christians living in the Roman Empire. Finally, we are at the River Moselle and at the Roman Bridge, which is also a UNESCO World Heritage Site, and the Black Foundation Piers are originally from Roman times.
retire into tea of all the vulnerable.